and you her courage, whatever you decide. I don't want to die. Have you ever heard the saying, let sleeping abominations die? That would be the time. You ate my entire bag of herbs, you foolish dog. Do not think I am unaware of where it went. It is your own fault for being so entirely gluttonous. Several of those herbs were poisonous. Mm. You should be pleased they Perhaps did not kill you. Perhaps I could have a try at that. Do not be ridiculous. I am certainly not going to give you more, even if I did have more to give. Yes. Oh, you have some nerve, creature. No, no, I Your think not. Your breath leaves much to be desired. Off you go. We shall see. I promise nothing. Return to the tower? Why did the Templars let you through? Are you here to warn us? The Templars have barred the doors. They will only open them if they intend to attack us. Is that what is happening? sent for it then. I feared they might have. What else could they do? So Gregor thinks the circle is beyond hope. He probably assumes we are all dead. They abandoned us to our fate. But even trapped as we are, we have survived. If they invoke the right, however, we will not be able to stand against them. If anyone could survive this, it would be the first Enchanter Irving. It was he who told me to look after the children. It's a long story. I erected a barrier over the door leading to the rest of the tower, so nothing from inside could attack the children. You will not be able to enter the tower as long as the barrier holds, but I will dispel it if you join with me to save this circle. Once Gregor sees that we have made the tower safe, I trust he will tell his men to back down. He is not unreasonable. Petra and Kenan will watch them. If we slay all the fiends we encounter on our way, none will get by to threaten the children. You want us to assist this preachy schoolmistress to rescue these pathetic excuses for mages? They allow themselves to be corralled like cattle, mindless. Now their masters have chosen death for them, and I say, let them have it. Look at how they live, servants of the Chantry. They lack respect for themselves and their own power. Why should I respect them? Of course I am right. Save her. 
Save them all from this half-life. Your advisor is an apostate. You are more dangerous than I imagined, and you will enter this tower over my dead body. We will give you your wish, old woman. Oh look, some more fun. Think again. Hmm. Perhaps I could have a try at that. Yeah. 